from Ireland. My name is Jonathan Power, and I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of how to create a custom settings page in the pods plugin. And we're going to be using that with a beaver themer and connecting it all up to display on the front page. So to get started, we'll go into pods admin, add new settings page at the bottom of the menu there give our settings page a title settings page then put in the label for the admin menu on the left we'll call it we'll call it team settings then you can assign where you want to display your label in the menu I'll create a new menu item below the WordPress settings here. You can see it there now, team settings. But there's nothing here yet because we haven't created any fields. So we'll go back into pods, edit pods, go into our settings page. We'll create some fields. I'm going to create a field for a Facebook uh, URL to display in the header for a, for a social media link on the client's website. Name will be Facebook description for the client. Insert Facebook page URL here. And the field type will be website and then just add it we'll do another field um, option that will be for a promotion and we'll put that into a team part to, to display on certain parts of the website so we'll call it promotion promotion insert promotion code here it'll be a standard text field or it could be could be a website either a url say that you are putting in a uh, probably something like google adwords something like that we'll put in address for the footer insert um here it'll be a plain text field and then we'll have a phone number in the footer as well so insert phone number here and that'll be a phone type field and go into additional field options and select the, the format I select no validation it seems to, I was watching a tutorial the other day and they said it's the simplest one to use it doesn't create problems Same so when we go into our team settings page now we have the fields we just created all here I'll go over to Facebook I'll select a URL for page put that into my team settings we'll put in some information for the promotion we're running we'll say 25 percent off for all of may put in the address for the footer Put in a phone number to show in the footer also. So we want to go into Builder, Team Builder now, and we want to create our sections to display these fields on the website.
creating my header first to display the social icon. Launch the page builder. And here we have our header. I'll just bring in a, a row and I'll use the, the icon module. I want to select my my Facebook icon. Ah, there's couldn't see it so we want to connect that icon to the f Facebook um, URL field that we created so we'll go right down to the bottom to the heading pods there and the settings pod that we created is there and it'll automatically show us the Facebook field that we created because it's a URL. I'll just make the icon white so it's easier to see. And that should be it. So we want to go back into our team layout we'll create uh, a new team part for the promotion it'll be a team part and we'll put it before the content and we'll say that it's only on one page home page So launch the page builder to build our promotion template. Bring our text field in, then select. Go right down to the bottom to pod settings. It'll be promotion, it'll pick up the promotion field that we created. So we put in 25% off for May, so this should auto fill when I save it there. See, it's coming up now, 25% off for all of May. And then we'll go back into our team parts. We want to create the footer now. For the address and phone number oh what have I done wrong there oh yeah location entire site launch the page builder we'll just get rid of this dummy content and we'll put in our footer information now. We click the plus for the select the field, go down to settings pod, address settings, save. There. We're just doing the exact same but selecting the phone number now.
there it is we know that it's working so if we if we go now to our home page we'll have all the fields connected we we have our Facebook icon is connecting to our Facebook page and we have our promotion just showing on the home page and we have our footer so when I create a new page just call it testing and my header and footer will all be there but the promotion won't because that's assigned to only the home page so there it is and then if we go back to our team settings I'll just change the address to number 12 Market Street West save it just to make sure that it's working properly and there it is so your client can easily update whatever whatever fields whatever way you build the site so that's it folks hope you enjoyed the video and thanks very much